Okay, so I already posted a really long video. Actually, I recorded a long video, and it sounds like I'm underwater, and um, I keep spinning in my chair. And it, um, it was with that crappy webcam um, setup that I've got, and it just kind of just is pretty shaky. And I'll post it if you want it, but um, for the most part, um, this is going to be my episode 4 um, version 2.0 update, I guess. I uh, basically was doing um, the past couple days for the 100-day challenge. I um, had the pleasure of doing a um, self-publishing workshop at the Fond du Lac Library, courtesy of um, Barb Rude. Thank you, Barb. Um, nice to meet you. And that was pretty productive. It was nice to get to know the local people. And this update is pretty much going to focus on Brian John Mitchell, um, as far as um, creator and owner of Cybermedia.com, and our Matchbook Mini comic um, story inspired by the Yeti and Robert E. Howard that we're working on. And I've basically have been um, going over a few different page templates with John, um, Brian John Mitchell as far as um, sizes and what's a more comfortable size for me to draw at, especially since I normally draw large on a large size, as large as um, 18 by 24 or whatever those measurements are. I told you I suck at math. Um, and this is me scaling down, so we're kind of gradually doing it and still trying to get something that will allow me to draw at a decent size, but yet also I've got to pull back a little bit in regards to the detail, because I tend to do a lot of detail, as you can see in the back. And um, because this is going to be a really small size, I mean, it's going to be able to put this in your pocket, um, hopefully, you know, if you pick it up or buy it, you should. And... Um, so the details are not going to be stressed as much as the overall composition and layout and just trying to get the story um, flowing as well as the actual narrative and dialogue because there's not a lot of space to work with and that's why I wanted to do something like this because that's the challenge and I love challenges if you don't know me by now. Don't always do the best with challenges, don't always succeed, but I love attempting challenges. So, again, I'll post that other video. It's pretty crappy. I'm going to warn you now, but this is probably the official video. And I've got one more video that um, we'll probably try and do the early part of next week, where hopefully, if I can figure it out, you can actually see some drawing or some more artwork in progress, rather than just some uh, having to look at me and listen to me talk about what we're talking about doing. All right. I am Jam Hunter, 100 Day Challenge, and I will talk to you some other time. Enjoy your Game of Thrones. So basically what we have here is a few different um, page templates and layouts in regards to the Yeti inspired project that I'm doing with Brian John Mitchell. And so um, he was nice enough to prepare a few um, PDFs for me. Um, to print out and so that way I could sit there and play around and see what size that I want to actually draw this thing at and as you can see there's different formats and just about trying to get comfortable with drawing at a smaller size because normally I draw large um, at a large size I've gone as far as 18 by 24 even so as you can see we've got shout outs to um, Brian John Mitchell Cyber Media and it's a little blurry I can't get it to focus right and that's titles not set in stone I think we came up with a different title and let's see here and not only that with um, the format choice I also decided to print out multiples of these so that way I can just use them for thumbnails for other projects and let's see here it's pretty much more of the same just different sizes and again just to get comfortable with working within this smaller space as I scale down a little bit for this particular project so one of many projects that I'm working on and I just wanted to take the time out to talk to you about um, Brian John Mitchell's um, Matchbook Mini Comics. He's got, oh man, I have no idea how many he's at, got right now, but um, if you check him out at um, cybermedia.com, you can check out um, a few different um, free options, and then you can also um, hit him up for, um, if you like what you see, you can hit him up and get more. And they're definitely worth it. I've done some reviews with the Indie Hunter on the Outhousers um, website as far as um, matchbook minis in the past and it's just nice to actually be able to get involved as an artist with one so let's do a quick pan and then we'll get back to our regular episode thanks